Round 1. Joshua is knocked down but gets straight back up. Joshua began by working off his jab while Dubois came diving in, with some success, with hooks. Joshua's work was cleaner, and he landed a right uppercut as he looked to be getting on top. But Dubois then ambushed AJ and dropped him with an arching right hand that dropped Joshua for a count. Joshua was on wobbly legs when he got up but was saved by the bell. Round 2. Dubois has let his hands go at the start of round 2 and caught Joshua again, landing some flush shots. Joshua looked shaky early on, and Dubois landed more shots. AJ looked open to shots with his hands low. Another round for the champ. Round 3. Joshua goes down again at the end of the round. The crowd has been a little nervous after that strong start from Dubois, but chance of, oh Anthony Joshua, go up once more as they look to give him a bit of energy. Joshua missed with a right hand and got caught with a counter left hook. He rolled on his ankle and staggered backward before Dubois landed more clubbing blows to leave AJ in a heap and taking a count. Round 4. Joshua down. Joshua was all over the place at the start of the fourth and he goes down again after a couple glancing blows from Dubois. More left hands rocked AJ later in the round and he looked close to being stopped. Joshua fired back toward the end, but he lost the round. Round 5. It's over. Dubois KOs Joshua with a right hand. Dubois produces a stunning co-finish. Joshua was on the attack and Dubois beat him to the punch to land a right to the jaw that left AJ crumpled in a heap. Daniel Dubois left Anthony Joshua's career in disarray after knocking out his English rival with a right to the jaw in round 5 in a first defense of his IBF heavyweight world title Saturday night at London's Wembley Stadium. Despite being the champion, Dubois pulled off an upset to inflict a fourth professional defeat on Joshua who was denied becoming a three-time world heavyweight champion in front of 96,000 fans, the biggest crowd ever for a boxing event in the United Kingdom. Much was made of Joshua's knockout form, and he entered the fight on the back of a vicious stoppage of Francis Ngannou in March, but it was Dubois' power and aggression that determined the outcome as he dominated Joshua who was on jelly legs from the first round. The victory sets up the possibility of Dubois fighting for the undisputed heavyweight title in 2025, against the winner of the December 21st clash between WBC, WBA and WBO champion Alexander Usyk and Tyson Fury, who were both ringside. Usyk stopped Dubois in round 9 in August last year. Joshua must now hope for a Dubois rematch, or perhaps a clash versus the loser on December 21st after another serious setback to his career.